My name's Jill, and I'm going to tell you a story Jesus told to a large crowd of people who would travel to hear him talk. And it's also about helping us to understand how God wants us to listen to his word and grow in faith and to tell other people how wonderful it is to have Jesus as our friend. A farmer went to sow. He scattered the seeds from his bag. Some fell on the path, where the birds just gobbled them up. Some fell among stones. They began to grow, but the stones got in the way. The little plants drooped and died in the baking sun. Some fell among thorns that grew up and choked them. But some seeds fell into good rich earth. Each of these seeds made a big strong plant, and every plant made more new seeds, thirty or sixty or a hundred times more than the farmer had sown. Here's some pictures for you to look at. There's the farmer sowing the seed. Here are the birds gobbling up the seeds that have fallen on the path. And here is the farmer standing in his field of corn that's grown. What does the story mean? asked Jesus' his special friends. Please tell us. It's about what happens when people hear the good news about God's kingdom, Jesus said. Some people don't really listen at all. So it's snatched away, like the seeds that the birds gobbled up. Some people are glad to hear it, but only at first. When trouble comes, they're like the little plants that drooped and died in the baking sun. Some people are so worried about the things they need, or so busy getting rich, that there's no space left for the seed of the good news to grow. That's like the seeds that were choked by the thorns. But some people really listen and learn. They are like the plants that made new, more new seeds, 30 or 60 or a 100 times more than the farmer sowed. We want to be like that, thought Jesus' special friends. And here they are talking to Jesus here. Please tell us more about God's kingdom, they said to Jesus. It's like a tiny seed, Jesus said. You can hardly see it now, but it will grow and grow as a little seed grows into a great big tree. And here is Jesus showing them what it would be like when the seed grows. God's kingdom is like finding buried treasure or a beautiful jewel. It's so special. You want to keep it no matter how much it costs. That's really good news, said Jesus' special friends. We must tell everyone the good news of God's kingdom. I hope you enjoyed this story as much as I did. And hopefully you will remember that from a little seed so much can grow. So next time you see a field of corn or barley, remember this story and you will see how seeds can grow big and strong like us, especially when Jesus is our friend. And now I'd like to say a prayer. So if you'd like to put your hands together, and close your eyes, and we'll say a prayer together. Dear Lord, we ask that as we grow, may the seeds of your word take root in our hearts, so that we can grow in knowledge and walk with you every day. We ask this in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you for listening to my story. Good night and sleep well. Bye bye.